I'm the hottest round. I told your mother, y'all can't stop me now. Listen to me now. I'm lasting 20 rounds. And if you want me, then come on, get me now. Hey everyone, it's me, Psychedelic Babe, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing a water test and we're going to be testing our magnesium and calcium. Now, the quickest way for me to do this is with the JBL test kit and it's super, super easy. Now, before I go into the contents of the box and what's in the test kit, and we're going to go into why I am testing for these. Now, a couple of days ago, if you're very squeamish, look away now. Um, I lost my cleaner shrimp. He sadly died and somebody said to check your calcium. So here we are checking our calcium. Now, like I said, the test kit is super, super easy to use. You've got your magnesium bottles, you've got bottles one and bottles two, which you get two bottles of. You've got your calcium bottle one, your powder, which is bottle number two, and then you've got bottle number three, which you get two of. You get a little measuring spoon for the powder, you get your syringe for your water, and you get two plastic vials, which are brilliant because you don't have to put a lid on them. When you're shaking them, you can just swirl them around. Now, I've rinsed these vials in our ODI water, so I know that they're clean, I know they're not contaminated with anything, and then I just simply put five mils of tank water into each one. Now, they're so super easy to use, so we're gonna start off with our magnesium and bottle number one. Now, we're gonna give it a really good shake. And you will notice when you open the bottle itself, it's actually, it's green. So you're probably wondering why it's gonna to change to the color that it changed to, which I think is really cool, because it's gonna go red. So we do five drops. So it's one, two, three, four, five. That's all you need is five drops of bottle one. Now give that a little swirl around. Now we want this to go green. So what we do is we get our bottle number two, we give it a good shake. Always make sure you shake bottles before you use them. It's really, really important. And then we open it and these childproof bottles are a bit of a nightmare. Now we add this one drop at a time. Make sure you count each drop that you put in because that's going to give you the result at the end of the test. Now I put a towel down, obviously, as you can see, and I like to just make sure that it's a full bubble before I actually insert it into the water. Because sometimes little tiny bits of water, if the fluid comes out and it's not a full drop, so it doesn't count. So make sure you get that full drop before you put it in. So drop number one, swirl it around. Drop number two. Number four. Five. Six. Make sure you swirl it as well after each one. Number seven. Right. Number nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Starting to change now. 13. See, it's getting darker. 14. And it's now green. So that's 14 drops. So make a note of that and write it down. Now, 14 drops, you times that then by 120 and that will give you 1,680. So make sure you remember that number. <laughs> so that's why I always write it down. So make sure you write it down as you're doing it. 
Right, now we're going to move on to our calcium. Now the calcium is slightly different. You do bottle one, and basically the same process, but you have to wait a minute before you add the powder, which is step two. So we're going to have a minute talking. So one, two, three, four, five. Now give this a really good shake. It's really important that you give this a really good shake. So while I'm shaking that away, we'll get the second part ready, which is the, the powder. Now, because we're only doing five mils, we use the smaller part of the spoon. You'll notice there's two big part. There's a big part and there's a little part. So we're gonna use the little one. And we fill that. You see, so it's level, and then you just pop it in there, replace your cap. Always make sure you replace the cap on that powder, it's really important. You'll notice it's gone red. So it's the opposite way around this time, basically. We're going to give that a good shake, a really good shake, make sure it's all that powder's mixed. You shouldn't really be seeing any powder at all at the bottom, so make sure you give it a really good shake. Then we're going to take our bottle number three and we're going to give that a really good shake. And again, same as the magnesium, we're going to count each drop as we put it in. So, if I can get the lid off. <laughs> That's one thing I can say about these, the lids are absolutely perfect. So, we're going to count these drops as they go in. So, one. Two, three, four, well that was a bit of a dodgy bomb, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, it's going slightly purple now, 16, 17, 18, 19, it always feels like you're putting loads in. 20, it's going very purple now. 21. 22. It's got to go below, that's purple. 23. And it's blue. As you can see, it's gone blue. 23. Now it does say if it's a very dark blue to always add an extra one. So we're going to add an extra one. So that's 24 drops of bottle three. So we'll give that a swirl around and it's, yeah, it's a proper blue. So that's 24 drops of that. So you times that by 20 and that is 480. So my calcium is spot on, it's at 480. And you take that 480 away from the 1680 that we had in the first place. So you take that away from that and your magnesium is 1,200. Now magnesium ideally should be at 1,250. So I'm quite happy with that because one of them drops was a little bit dodgy. So it could have been that. So I know that there's nothing wrong with my magnesium. I know there's nothing wrong with my calcium. 
So what I'm going to do is now, it's lights off now, so tomorrow I'm going to get the big test kit out. I'm going to test for my pH, my KH, my ammonia, nitrate, nitrite, phosphates. I'll do a salinity check and hopefully all my parameters are going to be in check. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a huge thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Otherwise, you will miss tomorrow night's video. So from me, Psychedelic Babe, and the JBL Magnesium and Calcium Test Kit, I hope you have a great evening, whatever it is you're doing. I look forward to reading the comments below. If you've got any issues with any of the JBL products, don't forget you can always drop me an email and I can get in touch with them and help get things sorted for you. So I hope you all have a good one. I love you all. Thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and most of all, drop me a comment below. I love you all. Thanks for watching. Bye.